Well, really, Bryce, it was like a seven year process. Seven wow. years. And back in 2010, when we relocated to coach at the Seattle Seahawks, in my mind, in my heart, I love football. I mm -hmm. love coaching, particularly coaching for Coach Carroll. That was the greatest job in the planet. But one thought came into my mind, Bryce, if you could imagine this, maybe there's something even better. <laughs> and I started getting opportunities. God providentially started opening up opportunities to give messages. And I, I can't even call them sermons, but <laughs> messages. And, and I got to dig into the Word of God more. And I was thinking to myself, perhaps... God, are you calling us to do this full time? You know, and because I was already leading Bible studies, God had me kind of as an evangelist, as a as a football mm -hmm. coach at the University of Southern California and at the Seattle Seahawks. God opens up opportunities to go into prison, schools, churches, wherever you want. You just give them a little Seahawk and then you preach Christ, you know, after that. <laughs> and so I was doing that. But was he calling us to do it in full time, in, in, in a full time capacity? So since. For 2010 to 2017, there was a whole wrestling going on, you know, and, and in essence, that was a huge process for us, you know, and as much as I enjoyed coaching and it was phenomenal, my wife and I were seeking the Lord. And as soon as we got to be on the same page, we, we believe we're called to do this. And so, you know, we, we stepped out of coaching from the Seattle Seahawks and at the top of 2017 and then moved down to uh, Southern California to pastor a church here in, uh, in the San Gabriel Valley.